we go. Boy Reviews! All right, welcome back to Born Reviews. Nick here, and I am excited to bring to you another reaction video. And I am continuing on with my Cop Universe series of reactions before I get into the movies. I've already reacted to Singham, the first one, and it's on our channel right now. Go ahead and check that out after you watch this one, or if you want to watch that one first, just go ahead and pause this video, go to the other one, and then come back and click resume. I would love to wait for you the whole time, but that would just be ridiculous because that's not how the internet works. So I will get Gabe or maybe even Jody if she wants to see some of these with me eventually, but I want to just finish the Singham series, uh, the first two movies. This one's Singham Returns on my own first. I am very pleased with the reaction from the first one. Solo video reaction videos don't usually do as well, but I got a thousand views in the first 12 hours, so I'm very happy about that. Thanks so much for that. And I got a lot of a few comments that said, how dare you compare this to Boggy 3? I understand that if you're a big fan of Singham. I understand a different type of filmmaker, but I was just talking about the over-the-top outrageousness, the action and whatnot is what I was referring to. But teach his own, it's all good. I'm excited to check out Singham Returns. The stars AJ coming back to play Singham, um, Bajiro Singham. And it's also got Karina Kapoor, so that's really cool. She's a big-time actress in this movie. And I'm assuming this movie was even bigger and better. Again, I still don't know. I have to look in the history of when it officially became a copy universe. But this is all part of that copy universe. I have reactions for Soria Banchi as well, The Night It Got Dropped. You can check that out after you check out this one, after you check out Singham, the first trailer reaction. Before I get into this, don't forget to go ahead and give me a like and a subscribe. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already. If you like what you see, it lets us know that you're digging these type of videos and you want more of them. And if you have anything to say, mention it in the comment section. I'm reacting to a Sing Returns trailer that has the subtitles embedded in it, which I absolutely love. So, without further ado, let's get into this. No slow, easy jam music for this one? Reliance? Come on. It'd be so cool to have your own production company. Bharat me 315 lakh karod se bhi zyada kala dhan hai. Mumbai police ke head constable ki lash ke saath karodo rupai bhi mile hai. आज राजनीति में सबको इनसिक्योरिटी है इसलिए सबको सिक्योरिटी है मुझे कौन मारेगा उस गुरुजी के एक एक उम्मीदवार की उम्मीद पे वार करेंगे सिंगम साहब <laughs> there he 
There you go. Don't fuck the bunch the same line from the last one. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah, so definitely was the same line at the end of the last one that I thought sounded like a, a bad word in English. Um, obviously, it doesn't. But it just sounded like that. So that well, that seemed even more over the top, which you would expect with a sequel, but it also seemed maybe a little more silly. And I'm just going by the trailer of the first one. I have not watched the film yet. Um, but this one seems a little more silly factor on there. But I do like how he did his patented car turning, drifting almost, him coming out. But now he's ready to do some some kicks as he's coming out and take some guys out. That was that was pretty cool. It was almost like something from a video game. I thought that the villain in this one seemed like a a forgettable villain. I already forgot him basically right now, just watching the trailer. Hopefully he's better in the movie. But I have a bad feeling about this one <laughs> that maybe it doesn't hold up nearly as much as the first one. And the only reason I say that is because the comment section from the first trailer reaction I did there was a lot of excitement about it. A lot of people that, this is a great movie. This is a fun movie. This is a good movie. And so that kind of already elevated that status before I've seen it. This one just seemed kind of a little uh, too ridiculous. I could be wrong. Hopefully I'm wrong. I always like it when I'm wrong, when I don't have the best feeling about a movie going into it. But that's my reaction to Singham Returns. You know, talking about trailers... One of the best trailers I've ever seen was a trailer for Man of Steel, which is part of the DCEU. Zack Snyder directed. I'm not a Zack Snyder fan, but he did a great job with that movie. And maybe, let me know in the comment section. Let me know if you'd be interested in me reacting to that trailer. Obviously, I've already seen it. But maybe you haven't seen it or it's been a long time and you want to watch it with me. But that is one of the best made trailers ever. I don't think the movie's as good as that trailer was for building up a movie. So if you want me to react to that, we can uh, try some older Hollywood films, then let me know in the comment section. I want to see like at least maybe 15 or 20 comments saying you want the Man of Steel reaction. Then I'll, then I'll do it. Because if, if not, it's just not really worth doing it on this channel. But that's a great trailer. This one, we'll see how the movie goes. I still am very excited about the whole cop universe idea. I think that's a cool idea. Why would that not be a cool idea? I think it's so cool. It's not just because the MCU did and it worked out so great. I think it's awesome to have characters in the same universe. Now, M. Night, his movies supposedly all take place in the same world. That's cool. But they're, the characters, for the most part, they're not connecting with each other. They're not talking to each other. And not just that, but Bruce Willis is playing more than one different character in that universe. So, anyways, there's my reaction to Singham Returns. Hope you enjoyed it. I'm sorry about the subtitles that were embedded. They were that white color, and there's a lot of light colors in the background. Some of those words were hard to see, but I got the gist of it. Definitely more dialogue in this trailer than the last one. But there you have it. If you want to see me see more, as always, I can't talk right now, give me that thumbs up that lets me know. And again, let me know in the comment section if you want to see Man of Steel reaction. And until next time, adios.